Okay guys, today I'm going to show you how to disable those pop-ups on Avira, the free edition. Uh, the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to restart your computer and hit F8 and then select safe mode with networking. Then you're going to download Avira and then this is what you're going to see. Um, I couldn't record the video on safe mode so I had to do it regular mode so I'm not going to be able to show you uh, the restart. but. Uh, this will work with XP, Vista, and uh, Windows 7. Okay, so you're going to go to Start. You're going to go to Computer or My Computer. As an XP, it'll be somewhere over here. Um, you're going to go to your C drive. And with Vista and uh, Windows 7, it's going to be Programs File x86. With XP, it's going to be Programs Files with no x86. Okay, so we're going to click the x86 program files then we're going to go to uh, Vira right here open up Avira now we're going to scroll down until we see AV notify alright right here AV notify we're going to right click it or click properties then we're going to go to security and now we're going to go to advance down at the bottom now you clicked advanced you're gonna double click system and if I was in safe mode it would allow me it would have check boxes right around this side what you're gonna to wanna to do is you're gonna to wanna to check traverse folders slash execute file you're gonna to wanna to deny that so put a check right there hit OK then you'll hit apply OK and then you'll restart your computer but you can only do this in safe mode the only uh, Windows version that you can do it without using safe mode is Windows XP Professional um, and uh, I'm pretty sure that's it so that's how you guys disable the pop-ups in the Avira antivirus version that's free uh, you'll no longer have pop-ups and it'll work just like the full version except for it won't use I believe uh, the email and um, scanning and stuff but who needs that it just slows you down anyway well hope you guys enjoyed this little video please subscribe